All right, we are back in my shop and we have the shoes that I was working on. Let's move this out of the way. So what I have here is a couple of dust shoes that I was working on. This one was the first prototype. This one is the second prototype. And then this one is the third, which is the one that actually works. This first one um, I had designed. I, had, I didn't design, actually. My father-in-law designed. And when I had opened the file, I think I had made some adjustments. So it was slightly off and it didn't work. So I knocked off the lip that was here. Then realized that with those magnets, without that lip, it wasn't gonna have the force to hold itself together. So I didn't even bother installing that or doing any magnets. But this one, I did have the earth magnets, rare earth magnets, and they are doubled up in here, so there's two under there. And then I just used screws on this side so I could adjust them up and down to meet the height in case I didn't get it machined right, I guess you would say. Um, but what I had found is when I had made it, I made a little too much play which means that when you have a little bit of force this way, it opens up. And you'll see that in a video that I have of that one failing. So then we made this one here. And this one, I made the tolerances much tighter with the lip. And when it comes to the magnets, I only did a single row, but I did a row in the bottom and a row in the top. And then as far as the, we'll call it slop, it's hard to see when it's on there, but it does not move hardly at all. So it does, you have to pry on it pretty good, but you're not gonna knock it off with the brushes. Got a nice satisfying clip and takes a little bit of pressure to take off. So that is the dust shoe, it does work. Happy with it. Hope you guys enjoy. We will see you, see you soon, back to work for me. So this is a view of the first and the second prototype. This is me installing the second prototype. Being happy with the fit, thinking I did a good job. Turns out when I went to resurface the board, didn't even get to make a cut before I noticed there was an issue. This is the second prototype failing halfway through making the third prototype. The one that works. And then this is the full cut. And this is what it looked like after it finished cutting. This will be a sped up shot of me using the third prototype and it working beautifully. Thank you for watching my videos. We will see you in the next one.